Hey there, Kingdom Builders. It's your girl, Danny Royal from DannyRoyal.com. And yes, it's been a minute since I've been on to post a video. There has been so many life-changing and shifting things that has been taking place literally. Um, but I want to share something with you all because God is literally shifting things. And he is turning things for our good. He's turning things around for his people, his chosen ones. He's doing something special and unique that no man or woman can put their hands on. Um, when God opens the door, no man can shut it. And when God shuts the door, no man can open that door. Um, and I just want to share something with you. As I was reading scripture today in Proverbs um, 15, 33. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. That's not the specific scripture, but this is what I am getting at. It says in that scripture that humility comes, he comes before honor. And, and I know that in the seasons that we were in um, just most recently, and for some of us, we're still there. I need you to understand that we went through, and I include myself because it has been something else. We went through things so that we could continue to remain or to get us to a place in, uh, of humility. God tests our hearts to see if we are for him and to see how bad we want what it is that we're saying. And I need you to understand sometimes in those process or in those tests or on those different levels, it can seem like we're getting beat up. And it can seem like it's not fair, like why am I here? But I need you to understand that in those moments alone, God was humbling your spirit so that when you get to where it is that he has for you to go to, you're expected in, that you are able to obtain the blessing and not get big headed. You are able to obtain the blessing and share and spread the wealth. You are able to see how far you've come. You're able to appreciate and value what it is that he's about to bless you with that you've been toiling um, and you've been begging and you've been praying and you've been searching and you've been wanting and wondering and all these things for, for all of these years. I can assure you that where God has me right now, I never thought that I would be, but what I do know is even in this moment, God is still continuing to humble me because he knows that where I am going is so much bigger than where I've been. It's not because I'm so great. It's not because you're so great, but it is because he's so great. And what will be revealed in your life is the glory of the Lord. And so I need you to understand that eyes haven't seen and ears haven't heard and neither has it entered into the hearts of men the great things that God has in store for them that love loves him and to those who are called according to his purpose. And I need you to understand that the word alone also says that the glory shall be revealed in us. The glory shall be revealed in us. So in order for God's glory to be revealed in us, in order for people to see the transformation, even though they may hold you to your past and what you've done and how you've moved and how, how, how you how you handled a certain situation back then or how you did not handle a certain situation back then. I need you to understand that all things work together for the good of them who loves God and to those who are called according to his purpose. So he was making it all well, even in the midst of what didn't look so good, but he was humbling you so that when you get to where you were going or are going, forget who got you there. You won't forget the people on the bottom. You won't forget how hard you had to work. You won't forget to pour into someone else. You won't forget that God, only God, and God alone has gotten you here, okay? So I'm your girl, Danny Royal, once again from dannyroyal.com. And I need you to understand that God is doing a new thing and he's been doing a new thing. And he's He's not, like, I'm telling you, like, he, he's in, like, in in the in the in the vicinity like he's in the blessing business and what he's going to be doing is doing things quickly when you speak it that so shall it be and when you believe it that so shall it be he has made you whole through your tri your trials and your tribulations and now you shall spring forth and see the goodness of the lord i love you all so much stay tuned I'm telling you, I say that all the time, but now more than ever is a time where you want to. On the next video, remember to stay focused, stay the course, know that you 
went through what you went through because God wanted to put you at a place to stay humble and be humble and and experience what it's like to be down here so that when he brings you up here and he makes your name great before men, you know how to handle it. And the capacity in which he's going to do it, you haven't even fathomed this capacity. You didn't even know that you qualified. In fact, you did not qualify. And that's why God wants to use you because man counted you out. And God's like, nope, I want to use him. Nope, I want to use her right there. Mm -hmm. They got what it takes. They have what it takes. Their hearts are pure. Their minds are made up. And now it shall spring forth. I love you all so much. I'll see y'all on the next video. Have a blessed day.